Hi friends, welcome to Get Droid Tips YouTube channel. In this tutorial, we will show you the steps to extract fast boot images from OZIP file for Realme and Oppo devices. Talking about the latter, the extraction of these files requires Python, and only then you could get hold of the desired firmware files. This will then allow you to use the system and vendor dump files, use the stock boot image file for routing purposes, and carry out other related tasks. So with that in mind, here are the required steps to extract fast boot images from the OZIP file for Realme and Oppo devices. We have already given complete instructions on our site. You can follow the article or you can continue watching this video tutorial. For downloads, you can check our article link given in the description. First and foremost, download the Python software. In my case, I have already downloaded it. So let me begin with installing the Python software. Once you installed it successfully, you can close the installation screen. Now open our article and download the OZIP Decrypt tools. You need to move these files later, so you can keep them open in the WinRAR or any zip extractor tool. Next, download the Realme firmware for your device. I have already downloaded it on my computer. So let me use the same firmware to show this video tutorial to you. Here is my Realme 5 Pro firmware. I will use this in this guide. You need to now open the Python location. To know the Python location, you have to read the note in our article. Copy paste the location address in your new file explorer URL. Your name is the PC name. For my PC, I have simply given the name PC. Python 39 is the Python version I have installed at the time of creating this video. So make sure you find which version you install. Copy the location URL and simply paste into the new file explorer. To confirm your PC name, simply go into this PC on your computer, open the local C drive. Open the users and you will find the PC name here. In my case, it is just PC. So make sure you rename the your name after pasting the Python address. Now move the downloaded OZIP Decrypt tool files. Just the four files shown here.
Now move the downloaded firmware or zip file to the same Python folder. Rename the firmware or zip to something short. In my case, I will rename it to realme.ozip. Open the command prompt window by typing cmd and press enter. This will allow you to open the command window in your Python folder. If you have opened the command prompt screen, then now we need to install the PyCryptodome and docopt by typing the following command. You can copy paste the command to your CMD window. Let's install the PyCryptodome. If it shows a successfully installed screen, you can now enter the next command to install the docopt. After successfully installing both, you can follow the next step to extract the Realme or Oppo OZIP stock ROM file. To extract the firmware, execute the command given in step 4. After decrypting, you will find a new zip file inside the Python folder. Open it, you will find the firmware files like boot image, but all the other files like system, vendor, etc. will be in dead.br format, which cannot be directly flashed via fast boot or extracted via WinZIP WinRAR. You can skip this method if you just needed a boot image. Our next step will be for those users who want the complete files which they could be using to flash the firmware using fast boot commands. Download UR tool. Extract the folder called UR Tool Master to the desktop. Now move or copy the newly created zip file from the Python folder location to the UR Tool folder. Launch the UR Tool by double clicking on the UR Tool.bat file. Since there is only one firmware file zip inside the UR tool folder, you should see the firmware file occupy the first spot. So type in 1 and hit enter. Type 1 again to confirm the extraction of dead.br format. The extraction process will now begin and you might see a few error messages, ignore them they aren't going to be any cause of concern. Once the extraction is done, the tool will notify you of the same. Furthermore, you will also see a newly created folder named One Project inside the URT Tool folder. Go to this folder and you could then access the extracted system, vendor, and other dump files.
With that said, we conclude the guide. If this video has helped, please like, share and subscribe to our channel.